Well, I just got back to Trosha from the farm. Had uh, 16 days of cereal harvest, so just got done uh, wheat tonight. So it was a pretty good run. So here's a look back at the last week or so, some of the stuff we've done, and uh, and a little video that I did kind of explaining the name of one of our fields. So I posted it on uh, Twitter and Instagram, and so I thought I'd uh, add it to this week's uh, video upload. So uh, enjoy. So just your normal morning of filling up the combines. Got that guy already full. This guy's getting close. You can hear it? So it's full. Yeah, once we're done filling up the combines and I'm moving some grain over here, I got the dryer transferring grain over and then hopefully in about four hours, we'll be able to get going on the weed again. Got rained out, got half an inch the other night. Uh, we got just got going on this other quarter of wheat and it, it was testing dry like 11.5 so hopefully it uh, dries up quickly here even though we got all that rain it, uh, it's supposed to be 28 celsius today which is close to 90 degrees fahrenheit i would guess and uh, so that'll uh, hopefully dry this stuff out so i can get going on it again last half section of weed here north of Rumsey. I'm uh, set up over top of the auger here at these bins just right on the field so it's kind of nice. I have the cart over there for when I get caught up I run out and grab from the combines otherwise they have to come in here and dump. If I'm getting behind I just had to move uh, to this other bin so but it's going really good. Uh, this wheat uh, is on some lighter land, but it's actually done not too bad considering how dry and hot it was this year. So pretty happy with that. Uh, Phil just ended up dumping in the truck over there. He's heading back, so it's going good. We're getting a fair chunk done. So hopefully get over our half of this field done tonight and then hopefully finish up tomorrow on the wheat. And then uh, we're waiting on canola. Chasing down calm. 
combines out here. I'm trying to find that uh, elusive one that's full right now. So. <laughs> from all three combines out there. Jaden's all the way on the other side of the field, so he's, uh, that's Ed, Marlene, and that one, and Jaden's way up over the hill there. So quite a ways away, and I was able to fit all three combines. Bill was only about half full, so that was a good thing, because otherwise I don't think it would fit, because this guy only holds about 750 bushels. But, Pretty handy little cart. I've had it for about 12 years now, and uh, runs on hydraulics, not a PTO, because this tractor doesn't have uh, power takeoff. This is my same tractor I use for uh, seating, so it's my four-wheel drive. Getting close to sunset. 